Last time on Solo Female Van Life Lessons, the Solo Female Van Life Facebook group met at a vineyard. We had a private tour of the vineyard operations by the owner, Kyle, and then a food truck and a band arrived. in my silly hat. It's actually even colder this morning than it was last night. Not last night. The day before. Yesterday morning when I woke up. I think I'm going to create a campfire just to sit around and be warm first thing this morning. Burn up the rest of my wood. Oh my gosh, look at this fog. <laughs> Let me zoom in. That's how chilly it is. I'll have to look on the weather. Let's see what the temperature is. Oh, shoot. <laughs> this door has a lot of resistance right at the beginning and then you pull too hard and then it does that. And then I just set up the uh, bird alarm outside. Fifty-two right now, but it feels colder. Oh, that sun is bright. Oop. I have a fire going because I'm chilly. And no one is awake right now. But we have had a fantastic time. Once again, so nice to meet these women. I knew two of them, camped with two of them individually on separate camping trips. And we just gelled and had a good time talking. We played cornhole yesterday. We played pool. It's just very low key, very relaxing weekend. We sat on the deck, we listened to music, we drank wine, and we just enjoyed each other's company. So ideal weekend, really. Beautiful weather, um, nice campfires, <laughs> nice people, nice weather, nice venue.
Too soon it was over and it was back to Oxford to check out the fire damage. down so it's quite a significant difference in level and that's why I put comforters in the back to pad this part so thanks for joining thanks for watching see you next time <laughs>